are going to see that it looks like we're getting right into it um right now okay so we are starting right away so yeah i was just talking about falcon matcha falco falcon uh both characters can have extremely explosive on openings uh falcon you know getting that reaction tech chase off one uh grab really good use of cc to connect it further and oh my god look how crazy this punch is yeah absolutely it's been uh, pretty back and forth um, Oh. Yeah. Oh man. Right. Oh geez. Oh, and both are off stage right now. Oh my <laughs> god. Okay, but Falcon was able to make it back, but Falco could not go the distance, and now Captain Falcon is up a stock, but he has a lot of percentage on him. Oh. Okay. Oh. Oh, nice. Gets that down smash. And we're back to even, and um, I actually know uh, both of these players are. are pretty good players, so um, it's it's no surprise to me that, that this is pretty even here. Um, both of them trying to, to get some good stuff started, but uh, both have very strong defense as well, so... Wow. Yeah. Ooh, okay, Ooh. that's gonna be stock. That was a great yeah. extension. That's a really great punish. Uh, just that shine leading into the down air, like, almost perfect yeah. percent to kill Falcon there. Yeah, that was super great, and I, I love the... Uh, definitely... Uh, Real. Ooh, he gets him again! Ooh. That was disgusting! Oh my god! Wow, yeah, Ben. Oh. oh. Oof. I mean, yeah, Fat is keeping it respectable, but, but Ben Snape was. Yeah. Yeah, um. Yeah, like I was saying, you see how explosive this matchup is, and it can be so exciting to watch. You'll see just one shine or one grab or one nair from any opening from either one of these characters can lead to a stock just instantly. Okay, he gets a grab. Oh my god, that regrab was crazy. Tech chase. Nice job to wait out. Oh no, but he extended too far. Oh, jeez. Oh my god. Okay, gets a grab again. Nice to cover ticket place. Nice knee from ledge. Okay, he's coming it back. He's bringing it back. One stock apiece, but Falcon is at 50%. Okay. Yeah, and again, it's a, it's what you were saying. I mean, oh, and that's going to do it. Okay, Falco just getting him off stage with, I believe it was either an F smash or some sort of uh, other aerial and then just able to grab ledge just really good punishes from both of those both of those players there playing very well um a really explosive start to this crew battle yeah i'm i'm not sure uh, how much i'm cutting out uh, it was just like you were saying um these characters both have very explosive okay cut out yeah i i see that um, they both have an explosive punish game on each other. Um, the stock can just disappear real quick, and it's it's an exciting, uh, tight uh, game one. And uh, Penn State wins the uh, counter pick advantage here. Yeah. Um, okay, so it looks like we have. I'm not sure exactly who's going in yet, but getting that counter pick advantage. Okay. Yeah, okay. So okay. Uh, Fox going in for Ryerson against uh, Ben Snape. Last stock um, at, on Penn State as a uh, foul. Okay, yeah. So we are. Uh, so, yeah. So Otez, the Fox going in against the Falco here. Um, matchup again, another really explosive matchup, I think. Uh, there's very few. Uh, like, there's not a ton of floaties between each of these guys, so um, not that those are inherently bad, but we're going to see a lot of fast-paced gameplay, which I think is always exciting to watch. Um, and, okay, it looks like Yoshi's is going to be banned, which, um, yeah, I think I do like. Um, I wasn't sure if uh, Ben wanted to maybe... Uh, <laughs> Hey guys, uh, Ben wanted to maybe ban FD to avoid the chain grab, but uh, yeah, uh, I think different strokes for different folks in this matchup. Yeah. Okay. Um, so they're going to Dreamland. Um, definitely going to be a, a good matchup. This matchup's a classic, uh, the Spacey Ditto. Um, 
another one uh, that can have explosive punishes on both sides. Um, you know, they, they can both edge guard each other, they can both combo each other. I think it's going to be a, a very fun and exciting match. Yeah, I uh, definitely agree. Um, I think that for... Uh, and I think it's pretty important for Ryerson to take the stock. Getting it to even can reset the last game entirely, and getting on that right foot and getting the momentum back in your favor is really important. And we are getting into the match right here. Absolutely, and uh... Oh wait, is this a hand warmer? Yeah, this is uh, a hand warmer. I think this is a hand warmer. Yeah, okay, so this is a hand warmer. <laughs> uh, um, but before we get into it, I just want to remind all of you guys, um, we just recently, this stream, passed the uh, Channel Point barrier to get to uh, Tier 1, which is really great. Thank all of you guys for using your Channel Points. But we have even more money prizes uh, to give out to the teams that are able to win. And, of course, all of the predictions. So if you want to put your Channel Points on the line for your team then make sure to do predictions make sure to put your channel points on to raise the prize money so we can um give some prizes to these awesome players for coming out and providing providing some epic melee for us to watch absolutely and we're already five percent to uh tier two so i mean in one night uh, we're already getting started on it so yeah very exciting stuff okay so yeah, looks like we are starting now. Um, okay, so the Falco, this is a pretty good punish uh, leading into the shine here. And this is a really good percent for Falco here. So could lead to a, uh, a stock pretty quickly. Yeah, Ben Snape trying to uh, preserve this advantage that he got for uh, PSU. But, okay. Makes that was it a back. Good, yeah. Oh, he's living? Oh, he makes it back. Oh, jeez. Dude, they're both playing. Oh, he gets him with the up smash. Wow. And there you go. Otis takes it. Um. So now. Um, yeah. Hmm. Yeah, I wonder uh, who Penn State's going to want to send in. So they have Dad as Peach, uh, Alex Trur as Falco. Uh, Young Silver as Fox, and Crispy as Sheik. Okay, so and... they are going to send in the uh, Peach, which um, I think I do like, because I, I like that a lot, because compared to uh, Falcon and Sheik, uh, this matchup is much more favorable for Peach. Um, I think most people would agree it's slightly Fox-favored, but... Um, but it's definitely, I think, better for Peach than Fal than definitely Falcon and definitely Sheik. Absolutely. And um, if you look at uh, Ryerson's whole roster, um, you don't see any matchups that are too great for uh, <laughs> for Peach. You know, you see a bunch of Falcons, you see a Fox and a Sheik. Um, so I think sending it in against a Fox, it's definitely a, a matchup that, that Peach can, can do pretty well. Um, I mean, I, a Peach can definitely win any of those matchups, but mm -hmm. some of them might be a bit tougher than the Fox, at least depending on the, the Sheik's experience. Yeah, and also sending it in while you're tied at stocks um, is really, uh, I think is also a very good strategy because worst case scenario is you get counterpicked. And then even then that's uh, based on the fact that you have taken more stocks than the other one. And worst case scenario, you get counterpicked, draw out one of their Falcons likely, and then you can counterpick with, your Falco or whatnot. So, Banland, uh, sorry, Dreamland is getting banned. So, <laughs> no, FOD is oh, banned. FOD banned getting Dreamland. Okay, Dreamland. okay, okay. We are going to Banland. <laughs> Banland. <laughs> Banland. Yeah. So, um, oh, good geez. stage for, uh, for, for Peach. You're going to try to, uh, live really long. And, mm -hmm. um, you know, the hope is that, uh, Peach is going to be, Far better at edge guarding Fox than Fox is at Peach. <laughs> yeah, um, that is the I think the main game play here. I'm not super well versed in the matchup, 
Uh, I do know that, yeah, Peaches definitely like Dreamland. Uh, most floaties like Dreamland a lot. Uh, able to live super long. Um, and I think uh, also the platform heights can help Peach, uh, I think, slightly compared to something like... Um, Compared compared to other stages, maybe like for instance Battlefield, which might um, compared to how where the platforms are located, it can be a little bit too. I think uh, how do I say this? Claustrophobic. So Fox is able to move around uh, way quickly all across the stage. While I think giving Peach the amount of room to play with is much better on Dreamland. Just okay, yeah, and. <laughs> Production is telling me to shout out the viewer count. Uh, shout outs to 69. Uh, I didn't want to have to do that, but they made me. But we're, we're getting hey. into the game here. Hey, listen, next time, I, I gladly will shout it out. <laughs> that's, that's a good number. And, um, you know... If uh, there aren't if there aren't 69 new followers at the end of this stream and you didn't follow, you are the one who's to blame. All right, that's on you. So you better follow right now. You know, keep up to date on these uh, these exciting crew battles and um, it'll be good. Yeah, and we are starting off really electric right here. Both of these players are having you know really great. Okay, startups on each other. You saw Fox with the up throw up airs, and now uh, he's going in. Some really great shield pressure, but both of these guys' shields are really low right now. Yeah. They're both at wow. 10%. Oh my god, he's getting oh. so much. Uh, uh, he's getting so much off those uh, down smashes, just able to, yeah. you know, throw him back on the other side of the stage. But this could be an opening for Fox. Yeah, I mean, Otest not ready for those down smashes. Bad manages to take it, but that up smash is going to take it, and we're back to even. Um, yeah. You know, Dad was maybe messing around too too much, floating right above him. You know, kind of tempting him to do that that up smash. I would say. Yeah. Um. You want to stay. Uh. Not. You don't want to try and get. You. You don't want to be above Fox as Peach because you all of his kill options are up there, up smash. Uh, up there, up smash and up air, and now... Yeah, he got like 70% off of two down smashes. Yeah, that's what holding down does. Yeah, that's that like... DC is so dangerous. Like, I'm, I'm oh, sorry, oh, Otis, oh. but that's, that one's your fault. <laughs> yeah, oh, okay, he has him off stage. Oh, what amazing patience! Wow. That was so great to recover by Peach, just waiting and yeah. waiting, and then finally <laughs> uh, air dodging the stage and just getting that down smash. Yeah. That okay, but responds wow. with a uh, Joe Shine up smash of his own. Okay. Right oh, away, man. again. Wow. That was like the same thing. Down smash, up smash, two kills. <laughs> yeah. Both these, I mean, super explosive matchup. <gasps> okay. Yeah, Dad is getting so much off of these down smashes. Otez just pulled oh. up, please. And he's spaghetti. Oh. He's living, though. Okay. That's a great situation. Yeah, but it's so hard. Oh! Okay, he makes Remember it back! A little bit of a missed up guard there, and now... Oh, that up smash. Okay. Oh! Ash attack! Okay. Oh my god. The down smash missions, he just stays in shield! Is he dead? He's no. living! Oh, okay, and that down smash Okay, we're very <laughs> Yeah. Oh my god. We're gonna see another up smash here. Yeah, we'll see if the <laughs> beats the tech away, and wow. now it's even last stock. Yeah. This has been all like, close so far. Both of these games have been super close. Yeah, this is uh, pretty nuts. Pretty even. What to see? It's a down throw. Tech chase wow. in there. Dash attack. Oh, but he makes it back. Hey, good to avoid the down smash. Oh, but he gets the ones. That's him out of the corner. Okay. Oh, Tess looking for a back air. Yeah, Peach is just playing around that. Gets yeah, those down one. smashes. Yep, he gets another one, dude. Oh my god, and the I think back that's it. Oh! oh it reverses! Wow. He did not want that hitbox, dude. Okay. Oh my god, it's been really He did it! He did it! Just grab the edge. Just SDI or wow. something? 
Oh! Okay! Yeah. Oh, he goes right down smash again! Smash! Dude, there's so much spaghetti happening for both- Oh, oh goes my god. Okay. And there you go! Dude, the DI mix up! Over there to take it. Wow. Forward throw, dude. He just. Or forward throw, yeah. <laughs> forward throw. He, he held away. Oh my God. That was wow. that was a really crazy game. That was back and forth the entire time. Oh my God. Yeah. Now, Dad got so much off of those uh, down smashes and he's able to take it in the end. So, yeah. yeah I'm... P PSU retains their, uh, their counter pick advantage here. And now, um, I, like we were talking about earlier, we might expect to see uh, one of the Falcons possibly come out for this beach. Yeah, um, I would be... Huh. So I think that both their Sheik and their Falcon can work here. I would personally send in the Falcon because I think you want to save the Sheik for the uh, Falcos since that's definitely a better matchup than the... Uh, Falcons that you're left with to deal with those Falcos at the end, but it depends if you're thinking of uh, whether you want to save one of them as the anchor. Okay, so they are sending in. Uh, sorry, can yeah, I sorry, get them one more that? time? Production. <laughs> yeah. So oh, Spotter? okay. So they are oh, sending the in the cheek. Okay. That's interesting. Yeah. yeah. No, I was actually I was kind of on the the same wavelength as you there, and especially since. Uh, uh, Penn State still has their uh, their Fox, which is considered a pretty abysmal matchup for Peach. Um, I, I'm interested to see what their game plan is here. Yeah. Okay. Shout outs to Free Palestine. Thank you for the follow. I think that's that is the real feel, Pat. Free Palestine. Epic Sheik main, bro. Very cracked. Thank you for the uh, follow. And we are going into I what I believe is Yoshi's. I'm very Yoshi's was banned. Yoshi's was banned. Guys, don't ever listen to me. And they're uh, going to stadium. <laughs> going to stadium. Guys. <laughs> oh my god. Uh, anyway. Yeah, Sloth getting uh, roasted a bit by uh, production. <laughs> okay, it's hard because I'm focused on talking and then I randomly get things in my ear and I can't even hear whether it's the stage. <sighs> Okay, okay. Production is... Continue. All right, I, either way, uh, we're going to have some good uh, uh, Peach Cheek uh, action going on here. Um, there's there's a lot of people uh, arguing in chat, uh, Ryerson versus Penn State, and you're just going to have to keep watching to find out. <laughs> yeah, um, and uh, before we get into this, I'm uh, excuse me, before we get into this, I just want to remind everyone to... Uh, make sure to give us a follow. Uh, we have these streams like all the time, pretty much every weekend. Uh, tomorrow, we're going to be coming at you with, for the first hour, actually two different streams. So you have two options to pick. I believe that's in the earlier time slot. I'm not sure exactly when, but we're going to have, I believe, both four... Uh, time slots for crew battles both tomorrow and Sunday. So if you're down to spend the weekend uh, alone, not having anyone on Valentine's Day, you can spend it with us. We will gladly have you. And we're getting right into it on Pokemon Stadium. <laughs> yeah, no, we, we definitely uh, will be sending the love tomorrow. Uh, <laughs> those, those two crew battles are at uh, six uh, when we have the two channels. Yes. Okay. Yeah, uh, Spoder looking to take this. He's got Dad in the corner, putting some pressure on. Yeah, okay. Yeah, Dad able to just come in with that fair and able to reset it back to neutral. That's really clutch by him. He was getting really bullied in the corner right there. Yeah, no, I, I thought for sure Spoder was going to get something going, but Dad's able to hold it together. Patient. And now he's got a chance here. Oh, yeah. Clips him with the down smash, but he's gonna have another chance here. Oh, oh just smash. rinse and repeats. Yeah. Uh, is he dead? Oh my god. And there we go. Spoder yeah. loses his stock. Penn State officially up his stock, even if uh, Spoder, or even if Dad loses his stock. Oh, he's going for. Oh my god, that was so crazy. I've never seen down smash into down <laughs> smash into F smash. This is. <laughs> Oh, Ooh, that was a okay. Stitch away. away. Okay, it's gonna be there. Right away. Wow. Okay. 
Is he dead here? I don't know. Oh! He actually needle there instead back. of back air. Back air could have been a better edge guard yeah. scenario. Oh, okay. No, but there's just, your back air. <laughs> yeah, just waits out the down smash, mm, sees it coming like very many miles away and able to cl clean out that stock, but not without losing one of his own. Yeah. I mean, this is the, the first real uh, stock advantage we've seen this crew battle, I would say. I mean, it's, it's been back and forth, back and forth, but it's possible that Penn State is going to try to uh, uh, pull ahead now. So we'll have to see what, what Ryerson does in response. Um, or, I mean, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. So, um, <laughs> I, no, 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 you're right. Um, but if you are Penn State, to counteract the Sheik, you have a Sheik of your own. You have the Fox, though. I think the Fox is pretty... Yeah, so the Fox and, is yeah. going to come in. Uh, I know that's something that you were pointing out, that that Fox is going to be there against the Sheik. And from my experience, it is... It's not, it's not awful. Like, um, many Sheik... Many Sheiks will complain about the matchup. I don't think it's awful um but it's definitely not great for chic yeah and i mean we're really seeing um the advantage that you get by uh, you know winning that counter pick you get to pick the matchups that you like and um you know we'll have to see um it's definitely not you know unwinnable for for chic especially if we're not talking about like you know top level or whatever yeah um so so I'll be interested to see. Hopefully, uh, Spoder can at least take a few stocks, keep this a tight paddle. Um, but I mean, Young Silver is going to want to, you know, really run away with this with Penn State now, especially he's up a stock. Uh, he's on a, a counter pick that he wants. Um, he's going to get to pick the stage. FD was banned, um, but still got plenty of good stages to, to pick from in this matchup, I would say. Yeah. So I think. For Fox, you, I think there's a, a a lot of different stages you can pick here. I don't think there's one de facto like non FD counter pick that you can go to as Fox. Um, I do see a lot of different Foxes, uh, depending on the play style they want to do versus Sheik, um, going to different stages. I'm but I'm not exactly sure which one he wants to go here. Yeah, I, I think we just got it. I I didn't hear it though because you. That one more time. Stadium. Okay, they are going stadium. Yeah. So yeah. So it's essentially right now since Pokemon has been frozen for a long time, you can think of it as almost FD Junior. So <laughs> if if the character dislikes FD, they likely dislike Pokemon in the same thing. You'll so you'll see a lot of Marths going to Pokemon now. You'll see a lot of uh, Sheiks avoiding it, and a lot of essentially that kind of uh playing out um it's a lot it's a lot smaller than or it's has a lower ceiling than uh fd but i know uh it's maybe as wide i'm not exactly sure what the size comparisons are but it's like I about think, as wide um... yeah um but I, not I having yeah, but not having those platforms to be able to use their shield drop aerials and whatnot and keeping Sheik on the ground with Fox is um, where you want Sheik to be, I think. So, yeah. And yeah, I mean, um, Fox uh, kills upwards, so that low ceiling is definitely going to be a, a boon for, uh, for Young Silver here. This is yeah. just a hand warmer. Um, it's like they're, they're ready to get into it, though. And they are already getting right into it you saw the uh, two taunts and we're starting off right now so we're going to fall off the side of the stage and we're going to be starting right quickly here okay. we go yeah so silva uh sweeter charging meals okay finds a grab oh doesn't Ooh, find the, the jab. yeah that jab was just a little bit late on reaction and now silva has an opening uh, gets him in the corner, but he still has him there. That was a good roll from Swooter, but Young Silva still yeah. able to push him in the corner. Lots of pressure here. Ooh, that yeah. was oh, an up smash. Did that shine Phantom? 
Yeah, it phantom shot. Oh wow. But okay, but he, still none of it matters. He finishes yeah. it out with a <laughs> nice out there there. Yeah, that was uh yeah, very strong start for Silver here. Yeah. He's definitely right. uh showing some proficiency in the matchup. Yeah, he's going for so many of those dash attacks, which um definitely much better at high percent, because they can lead mm. to platform tech chases and fares as you see there, where at low percent they're likely going to get CC. Not to yeah. leave much there, but yeah, able to secure the uh, stock there, so you don't want to spam him too much there. Yeah. Yeah, no, definitely she can uh, struggle against CC at low percents, but if you get that grab, okay. that's all you yeah, really need. the RTC. Oh, he jumps accidentally. Yeah. I'm not sure if he... Oh, Ooh. was that a miss ledge dash? Yeah, miss ledge dash. Yeah. And that's... behind uh, stadium's platform, or, uh, edges, so that's a really unfortunate one for, for Young Silver and uh, Penn State here. We'll have to see if he can recover. Yeah, uh, already finding uh, a good amount of damage already, but Scooter does have the grab, okay? Yeah. Oh, he oh. read Tekken Place! Yeah, uh, yeah. Silver has not been going for a lot of these Shine wake-ups, so... Yeah, no, Scooter uh, not not trusting his reaction tech chances Ooh. right there. Oh my god. Yeah, nearly got it. Okay, he read Tech Wake, covered it with dash attack, but not able to convert after, and now that's a really quick kill from Silva. Putting yeah. himself back in the lead with a stock advantage, but he is at high percent. Ooh, but he's getting some here on a uh, Scooter. Oof. Oh, can this be the stock? Yeah, he might be able to finish this out. Oh, that was really great. F tilt. Oh, he misses the wave on the platform. Okay, able to get the grab though. Dash attack. Oh, reverse fair. He's still living though. Oh, okay. That's a really good needle turnaround to uh, get to ledge. And even though he didn't get him off ledge, he was still able to cover um, after with that F tilt to convert to a fair and get that stock. Yeah, and uh, Young Silver's just got to stay calm. He's got good percent. Gonna break CC, but he's getting tech traced right now. Oh, okay. Oh, he went for the thing. Uh, oh no, he went for the whole shebang. Did he get it? Oh, oh no. Wow. Oh, All these Oh my god. Oh, ah! oh my gosh. Missed the turnaround. <laughs> no, he just reversed with the fair. Oh, he's still in the corner. Okay, he resets the neutral. Wow. Oh my god, falling there? Oh, what the fuck? Uh, Who's that? Wow. Somebody still gets it! And Scooter. Oh my god. Ahead for Ryerson. The first time Ryerson has been up a stock in this whole crew battle. Wow. That was so crazy. That was so crazy. He came down with the stock deficit. It was looking so bad. He was down a stock and percentage. And then it was just that one SD. And then he just came back, yeah. dude. That lost deck was oh, so that's, clutch. That's a that's a two stock swing there. And now, um, and uh, Penn State is going to be uh, sending in Crispy, their Sheik. Um, okay. So we're going to see a Sheik ditto. Um, at least one stock of one. Um, maybe Spooter will be able to get more going. We'll have to see. Yeah. Um. Yeah. Uh, I consider myself, uh, it depends if they chain grab, I think, is a lot of how this matchup can go. The chain grab can dominate a lot of this matchup, as it does a lot of dittos that have chain grabs. Um, mm -hmm. Fox on stay on uh, Fox on FD. Uh, I'm missing some other ones that can chain grab each other, but this chain grab is notorious for being like, and whether people do it i don't like it but uh i understand why especially in this setting like if i'm doing it in some sort of like random weekly it's like oh i don't care that much but if it's like you know you have your whole team on your back and like i need to take this stock right now so i'm gonna down throw you and then i'm gonna grab you and then i'm gonna down throw you again and then I'm gonna grab you, and then I'm gonna down throw you, so I get the <laughs> stock. You know, there's a lot more on the line, so I wouldn't be surprised if either of these guys are going to go the way, the the way of the lame, so to say, and decide to tell Jane grabs on. I'm not sure if they're going to gentleman it off or not. Okay, so, so they're, they're going to final destination. Um, the band was Fountain. 
Um, and mm. yeah, I definitely think, um, you know, there's, there's more on the line than uh, just your own pride here. So, uh, <laughs> you know, your team might get, get mad at you if you don't do the chain grabs here. I don't know. <laughs> yeah, yeah. And I think on FD specifically, the chain grabs are really like really good like yeah. compared to other stages where platforms can sometimes bail you out uh but i think it's very likely that crispy is going to be going for chain grabs based on how he counterpicked two fd but we will see i predict but we are going to get started right now okay yeah, so it'll be interesting to see uh, who gets the first grab here. Okay, they both go for okay, it. That's it, yeah. Okay, Peter Peter gets chasing. It and, oh. Okay. Yeah, it wasn't really this a chain grab, dog. just kind of some tech chasing to start off with, but. Okay. Yeah, yeah. yeah I don't not know. Going um... to... Gets the down to four there. Oh, oh my god. Okay, so. This is the grab. Yeah. Oh! Oh, that was actually... Oh. Neither of you guys really able to really get a ton of confirms. Yeah, neither of them can finish this off here. Okay. Getting yeah, to but... another high percent position here. Oh, those needles are oh. so good! Those needles were actually so good wow. for that edge yard. <laughs> oh, man. Crispy takes Spooter's stock to even it back up. This, this crew battle, man, it's like... It is so back and forth. This is like the most back and forth you could have any I have, battle be. <laughs> yeah, I have been watching and I'm watching and commentating many of these, and this is the closest one I have ever seen. And yeah. <laughs> uh, shout out to Hero for the follow quickly. Epic guy on Twitter that I follow, but <laughs> we. <laughs> We're gonna be, okay. So now, Ooh, poop. okay, Ryson is picking. <laughs> Sorry, who did they say they're sending in? They're sending in poop. The, one poop. of their falcons. <gasps> oh, I actually know poop. I know mm. poop. I've heard of poop before. Poop is um, no, 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 no. <laughs> I no, not that. Uh, remember Nun at Gommel? He had this crazy combo versus this falcon where like Was he. It poop? It was poop who, who <laughs> and it's like it wasn't like because he was he was bad. He like got hit this none. crazy tech and like meteor canceled and actually like did really well to but it's none. <laughs> essentially like but none was like here. I'm gonna cover you doing this insane tech and meteor cancel. But like yeah, okay. Stadium is going to be banned, and we'll see where. Um, yeah, we'll see where they want to go. Yeah, so it's yeah. gonna be four stocks to four stocks once again. Poops Falcon versus these sheep. And uh Ryerson, uh they're they're down to uh, their last two players, two Falcons, uh Poop and Midnight Blue, but PSU yeah. also down to their, their last two. Alex Trur, the Falco, and Crispy the Sheik who's in right now. So um, yeah. it's it's really getting down to the wire here. Yeah, and I think um for I think I think it's actually really good um, by Ryerson to sort of, I guess you could say, conserve or like save the Sheik for um, for here. Essentially, letting them uh, clean up that one last uh, Sheik stock from uh, Ryerson, and then now you have extremely favorable matchups for these last two. Um, yeah, a Sheik and a Falco versus two Falcons, and we are going to yeah. be going to Battlefield. No, it's definitely uh, the, the two matchups I think we said at the beginning that, that are going to be the toughest for, for Falcon to deal with. And um, it's, it's ending up being what Ryerson's going to have to face down here as we, uh, as we come to the close here. Um, definitely going to be interesting to see. Um, it's quite yeah. possible that, that, that Penn State's going to pull away here um, with these matchups, but it's possible these Falcons are going to be, you know, proficient in the matchups. Uh, there has to be some reason that they, they chose to send in Poop against Crispy, oh. and it's possible he, he's good against Sheik. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I'm telling you, this guy, when I've seen him, he's played really crazy. Okay, good jab reset. Yeah, both these guys uh, trading things early on. Uh, 
and the percentage looks even. Yeah. Okay. Have oh, just, oh my god! Wow. He, just, he punished tournament winner with just a knee! That was so crazy, dude! Yeah. Wow, just he just went for it. <laughs> uh, dude just went all out. Oh my god, I actually- Okay, so that was actually so- Okay, able to clean out the stock, but you, you saw that the Sheik was just holding down, trying to crouch yeah. control, and then Poop was just like, Here, I'm going to stop you now. Yeah. <laughs> oh man. Yeah, no, this uh, is so far a uh, pretty tight battle. I mean, they're trading stocks, they're trading percent. Yeah, um, and both in uh, the Puff matchup and the Sheik matchup, for Falcon, Stomp is really good at oh, closing yeah. combating CC, but able to get really good opening. A lot of good percentage. Okay. Finds the up air with the tech chase. Okay. Doesn't find it there. Really good shield from Poop. Ooh. Get up attack. Oh, he he's getting hit. The shield's so patient. Oh, oh, oh he gets him off stage. There. Oh, he's gonna get it. Oh, oh, oh soft. Oh, oh my god. And wow, everyone's back. Oh everyone's my god, dead. dude. Ah, oh. he's living. Yeah, oh, he gets him with the, the up, up air. air. Yeah, I was. I, was I think expecting just, a knee. <laughs> yeah, I was expecting knee there, but I think it's actually a really good decision because the Sheik landed so close to the uh, side of the stage that the knee might have been uh, not landed and gotten mm. soft, but yeah. Really great tech from Cat, uh, Falcon, but Crispy yeah, had no, the cover. Crispy. crispy just evens it right back up. Ooh. Yeah. And those back throws, even a low percent can be so dangerous. Yeah. No, it's it's definitely scary. You don't want to get your jump sniped. Oh, oh my oh. god, that jump this! Oh, close him with the fair. You gotta finish it. Oh, reverse! Oh, that was such a great back! Oh, but he misses oh. it! And Poop is back on stage with another chance of life! Wow. Oh my god. Another edge card opportunity. Oh. He hit the platform to get his jump back. Yep. Oh, 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 such a great reversal! He's dead. Yes! Wow. Oh my god. And That's now, he oh, was in playing so well, so well, just go wow. smashes him! <laughs> <laughs> All the way back to even, wow. I yeah, know both these players doing some, uh, some, some orthodox oh. things. Oh my god, okay. Find the up air. All of these games have been crazy. Wow. Oh, plugs that smash. Oh, but able to find the grab. Okay. Ooh, direction nice. Texture. Nice. This percentage. Yeah, oh, it's the Jerry set. Oh, the Miss Gentleman. He doesn't punish it. Oh, oh find the grab of his own. Oh, the there we go. Me. The knee. And now Ryerson's up a stock going into Penn State's last player. The Falco, uh, Alex Tro, I believe. Yeah. yeah and Alex Tro, yeah. What a swing for Ryerson. Now, now, now they're Falco. Um, I believe Midnight, uh, uh, I'm sorry, uh, they're Falco. Alex Tro is in the, uh, is in the worst place right now. Not, not hmm. obviously not terrible, but having the weight of being able to close out this stock um, without taking as many as your own, and then you have to do it again, go tip for tat. Yeah. So it's it's really hard. Yeah. So FOD is banned. No surprise. Mm -hmm. um, Falcons do not like that stage. Um, yeah, I mean. It's definitely possible um, for for Falco to, to efficiently take uh, you know Falcon stocks, but um, I mean we've seen some some explosive uh, punishes from these Falcons. So you know dealing with poop and then uh, you know a fresh midnight blue. Um, we'll just have to see if Alex Tur is able to do it, and they're going to stadium. Yeah, um, and this is where I think that the play of where when you send in 
better players comes in? Because do you think you want to have the momentum early or do you think you want to have them anchor? So I think those those are like the two schools of thought of whether where you want to send your really where you want to send your really good players in. That's like and that we'll see, you know, maybe Alexter is the hidden boss, you could say, or maybe if he takes this one stock from Poop, Midnight Blue is they just tried to Ryerson. Maybe it, I feel like they could either be their best player or their worst player, is I think the point I'm trying to make. And it's going to be interesting to see how this plays out. Absolutely. Um, and again, I mean, if uh, Alex Trur isn't uh, <laughs> isn't super proficient in uh, the Falcon matchup, uh, <laughs> he might have a bit of a tough time here against these two Falcons. But if yeah. he's really good at it, then um, it might just be curtains for Ryerson. I mean, I think I think it all hinges on uh, his his experience in, in the Falcon matchup, and of course, you know, Poop and Midnight Blue, how, how good they are against Falco. Yeah. Uh, that, that also plays a big role. And I think a lot of it can um, extend on what type of Falco you are playing. If you're playing the more methodical, um, neutral-based, PP uh, ginger Falco, then it can be a lot easier for uh, Falcons to, I think, do better. But if you're playing the mango style of, you know, crazy rushdown Falco, then it can be a lot harder because the pressure they amount on Falco on Falcon can just be essentially just putting you in a tiny little bubble that is your shield. And since Falcons out of shield options are kind of dog water, it can be really hard to get any sort of openings out of there. And once they have you in that, you know, that little like box of containment using shine, laser, back air, threatening, all of that stuff. It's really hard to get out. Yeah, no, he definitely can struggle um, if uh, uh, Falco is putting a lot of pressure. Oh, and thanks for the follow, Ben Snape. Uh, you know, good job earlier. Uh, hopefully, hopefully your crew can finish this out for you, Ben Snape. <laughs> yeah, um, thank you for all you guys for all the support that you guys are giving us. Um, uh, join the Discord, uh, all the stuff, you know, late registration is, I believe, still available for a brief amount of time. I'm not exactly sure when that is wrapping up, so if you and a bunch of your friends that either alumni still go to the school, anything like that, want to uh, join, we have open spots available, I believe. So, yeah. Um... Yeah. We are going I mean, to get yeah. into it, and with that, we're getting right into it very briefly. Yeah, I mean, uh, big shout-outs to uh, Lucky and the, the really cool thing. Great way to get uh, your, your college Melee community together to uh, compete in these and, you know, just play some games. All right, so yeah. uh, Boop, Boop giving up three stocks here. Um, one stock of Poop left for Alex Trur to uh, contend with. Yeah, and I think the explosiveness of this matchup can lend itself to, I think, both of these characters. And oh mm. my god, already with the power shields from Poop. Yeah. Oh, okay. Read second, he gets another knee? I can't believe he got that. Oh, but he gets a shine of his own. This could be. Yeah, I know. Both of these guys have got great, great opportunities here. Dude, Poop's power shields have been crazy. <gasps> Oh, is this a reversal? Oh, he charges F smash. Okay. Uh, you need to, to come back from poop. Okay. Oh, he waits up, get up attack, but not able to punish it. He just hit me. Wow, this so pressure, much all these rolls. Oh what is God. going on? Dude, I told you, I you're no spaghetti. Shit. There's so much spaghetti right now. Both these players know that this stock is one of the most important in the entire crew battle. Dude, I can't believe that up there reverse. That was so unfortunate. No, Poop, Poop did not want it to go that way. Oh! Now Alex Trur oh, got him off stage. Oh, Ooh, and that's and it. He's dead. Wow. Wow. And now, yeah, I mean, really wow. down to the wire. We're just 
a straight match of melee between Midnight Blue and Alex for here. You know, I'm sure uh, Ryerson really wanted Poop to take a, at least one stock, um, you know, ease the load on, on Midnight Blue here so he could rest a bit easier. But no, nah, this is this is down to the wire. Last player for each team, four stocks to four stocks. And um, I'm excited to see who's going to win. Yes, I, this is crazy so far. <laughs> as close as I think any crew battle has ever been. This is so crazy. You have, I can't even explain. You, this is last four stocks, four stocks. This is one game will decide this entire crew battle. You have, e and what I was talking about earlier, Poop was playing so well. Like he was getting those, uh, he was getting those tech chases. Like you saw that punish, but those two knees was awesome, right? And mm -hmm. those power shields were also crazy, but he just, was just some spaghetti from both of them. If that one up there yeah. didn't reverse, that would have been the stock. <laughs> yeah, definitely. Okay. So we're gonna be seeing this on uh, Battlefield here, Dreamland with Band. And um, I think, you know, correct me if I'm wrong, but I, I think we started out with Falco Falcon on Battlefield, and now it's ending with Falco Falcon on Battlefield. So um, that's some, some really good, uh, <laughs> Symmetry there, I guess. Yes, <laughs> really interesting, sweet. you know. And where we started. Yes, and oh man, I'm so excited! Like the first game was. All of these have been so exciting to watch. Yeah. And thank you all guys for sticking around. And we have it starting off right away. Last stock, Ryerson versus Penn State. Who will be the champion? Oh, he goes out already. Oh my god. so. That was so flashy already from Blue. Yeah, Midnight Blue trying to trying to finish up that stock, but he just couldn't quite do it. Ooh, that power shield! Yeah. Flubs F Smash, bro. There's been so many just like raw F Smashes from all of Ryerson's <laughs> Falcons. Oh, he oh, wasn't punished! Oh, and he misses it. I can't believe he wasn't punished for going out so far either. I'm just surprised the back air didn't hit. So wow. many back airs coming out from Electro. Oh, neutral! Yeah. <gasps> Dude, I'm surprised he didn't go for the dare there. And again, these players are aren't able to finish out these stocks. It's just back and forth, back and forth, getting each other. And there's an D. Ooh, now uh, Midnight Blue up a stock, but yeah, Alex able to get right back. back. Yeah, yeah, right back. And oh. this is as close as I've ever seen. Oh, he yeah. finds a knee. Okay, grab. <gasps> wow, shines him out of the knee. Yum. Oh. Ooh. Dude, this is so crazy. Oh my god. Oh jeez, okay. Both these players are playing so patiently, respecting each other's space so heavily right now. They both know that one opening could be the stop. Smash. Both these players are at kill percent essentially. Oh, finds the up tilt. He gets a go from there. Oh. I thought that could have been a down air. Oh. 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 oh, unfortunate tech flub. Alex is gonna try to take this right back again, but oh. Midnight Blue getting a knee. Yep, and now Electro. Oh! Uh, was, for Nair? was that a flood? I don't even know. Was he trying to ginger Nair? You don't I even don't do know. this on your stage. Okay, oh. and we get reverse back air. And we're back to even pretty much. Ooh, Midnight Blue. Yeah, he's trying to shark on the platforms with that up um, air. Oh, okay, really good turnaround up tilt. <laughs> Get him, get him, get him, get him. Oh, oh the my god! Oh, oh, no! No! And the side B, and now Ryzen the is at the last stock! Both of these players have been G's. Oh, every single game has been high, and it is on their last stock, and now Electra is trying to seal this out, not even letting the by Blue put it to the last stock. He's saying, I'm trying to clean this out, you don't even get to take my last stock. Oh man, oh, he gets him with the edge guard. Is that it? That's it. I think that's it. That oh no, he's yeah. taunted. He had to grab ledge. What are you doing, dude? It's not over yet. If he, if he throws this game away, oh, Penn State oh, will have to but there you go.